Sofi o desku yisui eta eti na eye TikTok. Na osaya die in a spiritual word. True eye degeta. Into wendu was TikTok no baswa. Na uko ni page ni suwa nuwa kache o wwen fana yo ya. Mi tine mi yo wasi fante institute. Eko wasi an eko. Obo yo ya wasi fansato obo. Eko wasi an eko. Usi si yo ya wasi fansato so eko eko wasi eko. Now, o din komo bi emisem kwa fwo bashe ne se si kaji jie bi koso. Into wa babo anti din komo bi. Ni mkomo an odin emi de yi pa. Metro wali kwinti amsi emi de. Eni se, wo osu wa fa jise se okra anu wa jen kwa. Ne mom unjin di se wo jise suni biti umu. Ne mom unjin di se obe timi di tumi anase obe timi di jidi abo mpaye ama nyanku poeti u unjin di. Entu oba koso fu yu adesu kwenye suwi ama ono waye saadi endi ama wa macho obaji usika u. Onye ni free mfama u. Wa boni tiye 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 apa pepepe. Mwa si wano there is no way so be banana so ye aka se wuntu ya ka obetua ade nti oso no yisu electricity we yisu no ma mebre wona so de mo ho nti wo asori awoko ade nti na wanko oso fo ho na mbompa ya mawo na obo no ho so no mbompa ya mawo eno sa de tie dia ono obaju sika wa kan de tete tete nti we de e medara se se wati metwa ni ti e de akyere gana fo afa eye kwan ofa so wo libeji nko fo sika Eni wa asu mbe so bitu yano. Wase unti ya kwa sofu ma ame hoi kis kruz. Enya fina ybe chotwe bia. Yonko ti sofu nse mwoli tuja. If you want me to pray for you, come to church. That place you don't pay, you don't give anything. If you want me to pray for you, wherever you are, you come to the church, I pray for you. We say give an offering so that we can take care of the bills. And then you say, why are you people charging? Did Jesus charge money? Did Jesus... Okay, go and see Jesus. Because I pay bills. It's because of human beings that some pastors have become very difficult. They've become weak. And so when people come to me and they say, I went to see this pastor, he was charging me. I said, why didn't you pay? Get out of my office. Get out of my office. Why didn't you pay? When you went there, was it under a tree that you saw him? You saw him in an office. He paid for that office. He had to drive from the house to go to the office. And you are telling him, he said, pastor, he's charging you money. So you let that. If you don't have money, don't you go to church? Don't you go to church? You go to church. Go and see your pastor. He's not your pastor. He does not owe you. I don't owe. Sir, you as you are here now, I don't owe you anything. No. My brother, if I am to see even 20 people a day, one on one, and I spend 30 minutes on one person, imagine how many minutes it would take to talk to all the 20 people. The whole day, eh? It will take you the whole day to see only... So after spending that whole day now, should I come to that person's house to come and eat? Should I come to that person's house to come and collect rent to pay for the facility? But you need to understand that it costs to bring these things, even this broadcast I'm doing now, it costs money. Show me where on your body you are feeling that pain you said you have. It's right on my chest. It's the right side. Pain has been here for over a year. So the pain, is it there right now as I'm speaking? I'm feeling the pain right now. I'm calling from uh, UK. It's not only pain. I'm having headache. The headache has been there for over a year as well. That's what I've been facing. I've been longing to because I've been trying to book online, but I don't know how to do the booking. So I was saying to myself, if I have my way, I will come to Ghana. Honestly, I don't mind flying to Ghana. I, I've been saying that in my mind. All the time if i don't get through i will end up going to ghana that's what i'm saying all the time in my mind wait the problem with you people is that you are willing to pay flight ticket from wherever you are and see me but when you want to book an appointment in my busy schedule you are not willing to support the ministry why i'm going to stop all that one on i'm going to stop very soon i will not i will not see it if you want me to pray for you come to church that place you don't pay you don't give anything because i pay bills and when you tell people you want to come and see me on zoom you want to come and look at look at the setup do you see the setup yeah yes so I pay all these bills. I buy data heavily every week. I pay for that Zoom. That Zoom you want to come and see me, I pay for it. I pay for electricity bill. I pay for the rent for this place. And somebody just wants to come and sit here. That is not my job. It is not my job to be sitting in the office for somebody to come and talk to me. And somebody just wants to come and sit there forgetting that it costs money to do all of that. If you want me to pray for you, wherever you are, you come to the church, I pray for you. They don't want teaching service. From here, right from here, I'm going into 
service to preach. After that, I will study through the night and in the morning I'll be and and so imagine when I'm making time from this to speak with you on Zoom. And we are telling you give an offering. We are not even charging you to, to say pay five thousand. There are prophets that are charging thousand dollars, five hundred dollars before you even sit in front of them. I don't charge. We say give an offering so that we can take care of the bills. And then you say, Why are you people charging? Did Jesus charge money? Did this okay? Go ahead and see Jesus. Go ahead and see Jesus. When you organize programs like this on Zoom, on Facebook, you tell them, come and sit down and hear the word. After that, we pray and God will speak to you. They don't want it. You organize church service. You tell them, come and sit down, hear the word. After that, we pray. God will touch you. They don't want it. I'm going to stop all those things. Yeah, so wherever you are, you are in UK, you are in Germany, wherever you are, you want me to pray for you. I say, I'm not the one who is sick. If you are sick, you just come. Come, fly. Fly, pay the ticket and come. Book for hotel and come. That will be cheaper than the free will offering that you will give. It's because of human beings that some pastors have become very difficult. They've become wicked. Uh, this person will come and tell you, I've been spending money on hospital. I've been doing this. I've been... You pray for the person. The person is healed. That's all. He won't even call to say, man of God, you, your ministry has blessed me. So I am sowing this to support your ministry. No, they are gone. Forever, you see them again. You see them again when another sickness comes. And so, at the end of the day, the pastor is praying for you. But then the same pastor is now thinking. The pastor is thinking, how am I going to pay the rent for the church? How am I going to pay for this? How am I going to buy data? And so, if I sit here 247 praying for people, where do you expect me to get that money from to be paying for all those utilities? And so, when people come to me and they say, I went to see this pastor, he was charging me. I said, why didn't you pay? Get out of my office. Get out of my office. Why didn't you pay? When you went there, was it under a tree? that you saw him. You saw him in an office. He paid for that office. He had to drive from the house to go to the office. And you are telling him, he said, Pastor, he's charging you money, so you let that. If you don't have money, don't you go to church. Don't you go to church. You go to church, go and see your pastor. He's not your pastor. He does not owe you. I don't owe, sir, you as you are here now, I don't owe you anything. No. And so when somebody spends time to minister to you outside church service, church service, when you are entering any church and they tell you pay money before you enter, that one you tell that person is a thief. Because church service is supposed to be anybody should enter. You understand? But this one, you organize five days program. Seven days program, you will not come for one. But he wants to come and see you in the office. Even someone was offended that I said that he has to get appointment to talk to me. Someone was offended. One Nigerian guy, he was insulting my administrator. Who do we think we are? Why do we think he needs appointment to talk? My administrator should give him my personal number or he should come and give the phone to me. You don't know how busy I am. I am preaching from one point to the other. The other I have a church I run. I have a family. I have personal life. I have a prayer time. You can't just call me at any time and, and, and tell me, pray for me. I have something I want to tell you. You can't do that. And so when you meet, when they tell you that you need an appointment, you need so that I will know that tomorrow morning at nine o'clock, I am speaking to you so that I will plan accordingly and sit down and so that I'll be in that space. You are not telling me to do carnal things for you. I have to do a spiritual activity. And for me to pray for you for it to work, I have to be in that sense, uh, uh, state of mind. Sometimes I tell my admin, look, shut the phone off. Shut the phone off. If anybody calls you, tell them to come to the church. Because we are tired of explaining why you must give an offering. We are tired. Some people are even living a walking distance from the church. They won't come to, they want to come and see you personally one on one. And they don't know that it costs money to do that. They want to come and sit down with you one on one. My brother, if I am to see even 20 people a day, one on one, and I spend 30 minutes on one person, imagine how many minutes it would take to talk to other 20 people the whole day you take you the whole day to see only so after spending that whole day now should i come to that person's house to come and eat should i come to that person's house to come and collect rent to pay for the facility that is what the other time myself and dr ojaba we were discussing here people took it out of context and were insulting us but you need to understand that it costs to bring these things even this broadcast i'm doing now it costs money you know it is well it's mc and i saw from the two jack i watch it say so we nim now to na de si hoa en ye tiase ese wono obaju sika enye se obeye de achawo because jesus now so jesus ye cheye de akko jesus olon san yade ye into go na ade ope en wa ko bra ho ntina me ka chose don't go there the moment abe tu na de si wono obaju sika the moment abe tam wa japa ho e de awura ose kurbu no obaju sika because wa ko be bia wo hu ni so ni pa kwa ni powerful too much 
e wo sesa ni pa konti wo weke bibi de mawo wo na wonya jide wo na akoo yo enti de beto bi ana beto enti so mbe so be tue sika bi a me ntu na mfansi ho me wo asofo me bri numbers na na ka me de me from nko mo nche because me nim se wo wo ansa be tu na de si wo na na pam ni ti me koso wo ti de me kani pa enti wo ka se in wa kan si su dua wo se enye amosia ene leto petru enye amosia ene leto light ni ade ade e ye ni pa sika ene ade to it is also one bra, and as all called one bon pia more dear. Now what tia say said, we be be our no cum and who che be o cum beyond, who be to be the man. A case close. Yet the mark on fancy can also know one yanisa, and to an opa was sorry. So called metal is no upon us as still and so now be ban horn over Jusica. Case close, men, yeah, Jenny. And tea a babusha for beyond type. Don't go there. I had a say, don't go there. Utu nine the sea hole, near Jusica, ye be dee. Ye dear, ye dee, a wawas. So, Percy features right short of for the and then I found what dom is unique laser whitening. Unique laser whitening, I will two paces from Quan. So, what did you choose? Say, and more was seen a year fitter. Now, a year fitter, no, so no. No, a ye and carbony beer were no mobia. Any tea stains, coffee stains, smoking stains, he beer were no mobia. Unique laser whitening product. A beginning in every summer, come on, come on. The only answer, say, over to so. Na o de ego o brush no so. O wi a na o de twetwe o sene so nyina. Kama. O wi a en wuru anum gen wonu musa. Into contact Unique Laser Whitening. I was 0799972330. 0799972330. Unique Laser Whitening. O se muni